Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Sean from Tenacious Fitness. Uh, I want to go over an exercise of the week today. And the exercise of the week today is going to be uh, shoulder protraction and retraction. Um, what we're going to be doing is showing you an exercise how to um, utilize the muscles of the shoulder blade and then also help support uh, muscles of the rotator cuff. Um, also, sometimes I get people who come in and they have problems in their neck or um, pain from stress as well. For, uh, for example, sitting at a computer all day or um, driving in a car all day, sometimes they develop stress here in the um, posterior region of their neck and upper chaps. So um, without further ado, here's the exercise. Pretty simple exercise. Um, I'm going to bring my elbows up about armpit height. I'm going to make a 90 degree bend in my elbows. Okay. There's from a side view, from a front view. I want to make sure once again that my elbows are about armpit height. And I'm going to bring my shoulder blades back so that my shoulder blades pinch. And I feel a little, uh, little muscle activation going on in between my shoulder blades, kind of in the upper traps as well, here in the teres region too. So I'm going to bring them back. That's called retraction. I'm going to flex and hold for a second and then push my collarbones forward, also while maintaining that 90 degree bend in my elbow. That's called protraction. So we're going to retract and then protract. So retract, I'm going to feel pressure, feel force production, muscle activation in my, um, in my shoulder blade region. And then when I push my collarbones forward, I'm going to feel muscle activation, kind of my pecs and the muscles under my armpits as well. <clears throat> okay. So from a side view, I have retraction and then protraction, right? You can see I'm kind of gliding my shoulder blades back and forth. Okay, and then once again, here we go from back view. Hope you guys can see it. Retraction, protraction. Flex and hold. Retraction, protraction. So by keeping my elbows up, I'm keeping all of this anterior deltoid region uh, activated. I'm also getting a little bit of the tra trap area activated. And then I'm also working my shoulder blades behind me. I get a quick flex and hold for about a second, then push forward, go back, push forward. So there it is, shoulder protraction and retraction. Now, how can this help you? Well, if you suffer from any sort of rotator cuff problem, um, stress in the upper neck and shoulder region, or any other type of uh, shoulder injury, um, this exercise alone can make a big difference because what you're doing is you're helping to strengthen all the muscles of scapular stabilization, scapula is your shoulder blade. So if you can strengthen those guys, you're going to hold that shoulder blade into place and then you're not going to get a lot of shifting and irritation here in your shoulder joint. Um, hope this helps guys. If you have any questions, feel free to email me, email me or, um, you know, check out the website for plenty more good content to come. Um, hope you guys have a good day. Thanks for stopping by. Sorry, my hips are in a nice flex position.